The following is an adapted version of Dream Street by Trisha Alam Walker and Akua Holmes. Dream Street. Welcome to Dream Street, the best street in the world. Just ask the people who live here. The houses and the dreams inside are different as thumbprints. The sidewalks are wide enough for huge chalk drawings and giant hopscotch boards. Children from all over the neighborhood come to play until the streetlights go on. Yusuf waits for his brother Biko at the corner of Humboldt Avenue and Dream Street. He's thinking about how their mom always says, don't leave the house without your crown. She likes to tell them stories about their ancestors, who were queens and kings with dreams they never gave up on. Each morning, unless it's raining, Mr. Sidney reads the newspaper on his stoop. Dressed to the nines, Miss Sarah likes to say, What's the nines? a child will ask, and Miss Sarah will answer, Fancy, fancy. Mr. Sidney is a retired mail carrier living his dream of never having to wear a uniform again. He tips his big brown fedora and greets everyone with, Don't wait to have a great day. Create one. Belle catches butterflies in a jar when they fly near Miss Sarah's bird bath, but she always lets them go before too long. Everything has a right to be free, she says. And every butterfly is different, just like snowflakes and people and dreams. Belle wants to become a scientist who studies butterflies. She says there's a special name for it, a lepidopterist. Azaria's house is next to the park. That girl can really jump some rope. She can do double dutch on one leg at a time. She can turn around and touch the ground. She can jump by herself with two ropes. She can even dance, jump, and dream of winning a shiny trophy one day, all at the same time. When she flies down the street swinging her rope, she lifts her long brown legs as high as the sun. Eid lives on the top of the hill and searches for treasures that others throw away. She collects smooth rocks, broken jewelry, leaves and feathers, and adds them to her drawings of people on Dream Street. Meanwhile, her cousin Terry pays attention when new folks come around so she can make up stories about them. In her notebook, she scribbles down the things she hears when they don't know she's listening. The cousins dream that someday they'll create a picture book together about everyone they know and meet on Dream Street. The garden behind Dessa Ray's house overflows with plants you don't see every day. Purple lilies, red desert peas, and yellow passion flowers. Her magnolia trees smell like milk and honey and make your eyes feel heavy as if they want to close. Dessa Ray's locks are so long she can wrap them around her shoulders like a shawl. Sometimes she and her grandbaby, Little Song, fall asleep together. Little Song makes sweet sounds and dreams little girl dreams. When she was small, Miss Paula loved to twirl on her tiptoes up and down Dream Street. Now she teaches African dance at the rec center, her head wrapped round and round with bright fabric until it's high as a pyramid. Her feet move lightning fast, slap, slap, slapping and tap, tap, tapping the floor, keeping pace with the drummer's hands. Watch out, you might get dizzy if you stare too long. Sometimes when the rhythm takes hold, her wrap unravels and falls to the ground. She never stops moving, even as she stoops down to pick it up. Little Benjamin, who lives in the purple house next to the park, is tucked snugly into bed, but he doesn't want to go to sleep and dream. He might miss something important. He hugs his teddy bear, Tyler, who isn't ready for sleep either. Instead, they count the stars that sparkle through the bedroom window and listen to laughter outside from the big kids who don't have to go to bed yet. The children who live and play on Dream Street can become whatever and whoever they want. 
because their dreams are nourished and cared for. Just like Desiree's flowers. There is no need to worry or to rush. They take their time, growing and playing, learning and living, and soaring skyward toward all the adventures that await them. The end.